everyone just want to let you know that this video here is a review by red Pog gaming of the pile pmx 44t i accidentally hit streaming when i was recording this so i had to download it so sorry for the video quality still i hope you find this video very educational thank you yeah this thing this sound board what you see what i got it's in tin foil Aluminum foil, not tin. It's not tin anymore. It's aluminum. But yeah, I'm going to tell you exactly why it is in aluminum foil. The reason is because it is a hunk of junk. I tried. I, I really, really did try to get this to work. I mean, it will connect an XLR to a computer. Beautiful. But the sound quality is horrible. The sound quality, to give you an idea, is worse than my headset. This is the Astro A10. And this, this thing right here costs like $40 or something. That headset, I think, costs $40 with a better mic that didn't need uh, a noise gate. That's why I have this aluminum foil on it, was specifically to try and reduce the amount of electrical noise. But the issue, as you can see, it didn't matter. You, you put it underneath a monitor, you'd hear static or electrical noise, all kinds of crazy things. So I, I moved it somewhere else. I moved it underneath my desk. And I guess once I got better gaming equipment, better streaming equipment, it just the, just the littlest amount of electrical noise basically made it almost impossible not to use a noise gate or a noise suppressor. But that's just the beginning, the beginning. These, these, hang on, where am I going? These knobs here, they do absolutely nothing except make the noise worse. The gain controls suck. They do basically nothing. You might as well use uh, some kind of uh, third-party software uh, noise gain. Like right now, I stream with OBS. I use that. I used to use that for noise gain. Um, I, I don't really know. I mean, uh, it's got Bluetooth function. Wow. Oh, I guess if you wanted to put Bluetooth to your phone for forty dollars. But like like this this high and low and FX and pan and they just they just all did nothing. I did a review saying that this was okay for entry level. No, do not buy this. This is not even worth the paper weight. I think you can get a stack of paper for four dollars. This was forty ten times that amount. It's junk. So that is my review. Well, part two, because. I didn't know anything when I reviewed this for the first time, and I thought it was grand that I was able to get it to work. And I thought for an entry-level person, it would have been a, a good a good device for the price. Is not, do not recommend this. Do not buy it. Move on. You can buy, which I will put a uh, either a picture up and a link in the description to a XLR to USB cord that does so much more than this hunk of junk ever did for like 10 bucks. I think it's 15, maybe 15, I don't know. Like I said, link will be in the description. I'll probably put a picture over my head or something and yeah. So if you wanna go from an XLR mic to computer interface, for cheap money, go with the cord, uh, the XLR to USB cord. Uh, that's what I was using until I got my new soundboard, the Go XLR. So far, fabulous board. Um, just way more more than I think I, I really needed. You know, it's 500 bucks, but um, I'm at that point now where I can uh, get high-end equipment, which is nice. But... This is for all you people that want to stream, 
you're just getting into it or want to do some at home music mixing, please do not spend the money on this product. You'll be so disappointed as I was. Um, later on, maybe I'll do a review of the Go XLR. Um, and if you have the money to spend on it, so far right now, after using it for about a week, I highly recommend it. So much more functionality, has no noise. It's even got its own noise gate, but even without the noise gate, I almost can't hear any noise coming through my mic, which obviously you, you know, I'm using the Shure SM57. Sorry, 58, 58. Yeah. And that's my review. That is my final word on this product. I hope this helps someone from making a horrible mistake like I did in just wasting $40. I think it was $40. I don't know what it is now. Might not even be available. But I'm putting this out here in case you find one and you think you want it. You do not want it. All right. Bye.